Hi friends, welcome to my channel Civil 3D Pro Designer. We are going to start chapter number 15 about designing pressure pipe networks and this video is just for introduction of designing pressure pipe networks. You must need to know some things about uh, pressure pipe network before starting our exercises. Now that uh, we have studied gravity pipe networks it's time to move on to a different type of pipe design one that involves pipes under pressure if you are uh, unfamiliar with pipe design you may be surprised to discover that the design process for gravity and pressure system is quite different for this uh, reason the AutoCAD Civil 3D software provide two unique tools one of for gravity pipe networks and one for pressure pipe design Pressure pipe design most commonly refers to water supply lines but it can also apply to natural gas and sanitary sewer lines also. <coughs> Sorry. These pipelines provide valuable utility services to the new resident of the land you are developing and must undergo extensive design to ensure that they function as intended and integrate well with surrounding feature whether new or existing so in this chapter we will learn about pressure pipe networks we will create pressure pipe networks and we will also edit pressure pipe networks before any exercise we must need to understand pressure pipe networks gravity system design and pressure system design are quite different and must be addressed using different tools for a pressure pipe network designed to be a success it must meet the following basic requirements of the networks the bends and curve must be constructed according to industry standard fitting and allowable joint deflections the pipe must be sized according to specific flows and pressures. The pipe must be far enough underground to avoid being damaged by freezing or activities on the site. The pipe must not be so far underground that it is cost prohibited to install them. Appurtenances such as valve and hydrant must be include, included in the design to allow the lines to be controlled. These requirements relate to three basic type of pressure pipe ne design component fittings, pipes and appurtenance. This chapter describes these components as well as their relationship to each other when represented in a civil 3D pressure network. Understanding pressure networks and uh, pressure pipes like gravity pipe pressure pipes are used to convey a substance but the main difference of course is that the substance is moved by pressure rather than gravity in pressure pipes network. For this reason elevations are not nearly as important to ensure adequate flow. They are important However, to ensure that the pipeline has adequate cover to prevent freezing or physical damage and that it avoids underground obstacles, including other pipes also. In the image of conflict, because pressure pipe flows is not uh, dependent on elevation, a designer will typically bend a pressure pipe to avoid a uh, gravity pipe rather than the other way around as discussed previously the required bands are a design challenge because of the limitation of available fittings and deflection so in this chapter we will uh, practice pressure pipe network and we will also design and edit our pressure pipe networks for our real time project which we are already working with it if you are new and looking for civil 3d complete course uh, from basic to advanced knowledge then you can 
subscribe my channel civil 3 d pro designer and you will find all chapters in playlist like chapter 1 2 3